Hey YouTube, this is CS the Tutorials, and uh, this is uh, well technically episode two of my tutorial for Windows Vista command prompt. Okay, let's start out with some new stuff here. Um, what you can do is you can also type in um, what is it now? It's okay. You rename. Oh, oh, right one. Okay, rename. Which allows you to rename a file or more files if you want to. Uh, type that in. Uh, rename. Blah, and type in what you want to rename. But uh, that's about it. Also, you can do color. Um, yeah, hold on. Color. Then you type in your color, which is blue. Um, as you can see, this is how you can get your different backgrounds and all that stuff. Um, here you can do by your your digits right here. All if you want to do, all you have to do is follow these instructions. Type in color and then space and then just type in a color and then it'll give you this layout right here. And you can read this and um, let you choose your color. Uh, I'm just gonna do the example they have right here. Type in color, then FC, and oh look at that! Just changes it back and it just changes your command prompt layout colors. Um, we're going to change it back to my original colors, which will be, let's see, um, uh, let's see, what was it, uh, seven zero, oh, no, wrong one, color zero seven, uh, about to put the space, sorry guys, this is taking a little bit, zero seven, there we go, back to the original layout now, okay, that's color for you, um, now all you want to if you want to do something else let's see what else we got um what else do I have wrote down for you guys um oh um, let's see what else do I have written down um oh okay um you can also do a s s o c which is basically associate which uh this will display it displays or modifies your, or you, it'll let you display or modify your file extensions. Uh, as you can see, this is all the file extensions for every single um, application on your computer, which uh, just shows you. It basically just shows you all the uh, extensions for every file type. And if you don't know what an extension is, an extension is like you know when you have uh, when you type up a document on like when Microsoft Office, and you have .dox, which is just basically doc. That's what that's the file extension uh, and uh, yeah. Um, all right now, if you want to display and modify the boot uh, the disk boot time, all I have to do is type in C H K N T F S, which uh, check N T F S. N T F S is a type of file system for Windows and Linux and Mac. Oh uh, well, not Mac. I don't think uh, I'm not sure, but I have to do is type that in. Uh, yes, it wants you to continue let you continue here yeah um hmm. uh, it just lets you modify it or whatever but uh you, it just checks it um uh let's see you also do have cd it, this is this right here shows you where uh shows you the display name uh of the current directory you're in just C drive slash user slash my CS3 tutorials account. Um, let's see what what else is there that I haven't covered. Uh, oh yeah, D E L, which is basically short for delete. Uh, you can delete uh, one or more files with that. Uh, D I R. This just shows you to the directory of CS3 tutorials. As you can see, contacts, desktop, and favorites, links, and all that good stuff right here in my video of the last one I did. Uh, part one, which is po, which I'll po, which is in the uh, annotations of this video. Click on it, go check out the first one. Also, I want to give you a. This is called ping, and you type in 192.168.0.1, which is a basic IP address for every computer. Uh, it just goes. This is for almost every computer. Actually, it is for every computer. Uh, maybe not Mac, but uh, this is for every Windows computer out there. So you type ping, and. Uh, it just goes to your uh, IP, ad your main IP address, which is uh, basically for your router. Every router has this IP address, and um, as you can see, I sent four and I received four, and it lost no uh, connections to it. And also, you can also ping websites like ping uh, HTTP on uh, no, 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 
youtube.com and it'll go ping YouTube and it'll come back relaying your uh, da data and saying how long it took you to go to YouTube it goes to the YouTube server and then comes back to you uh, this is it took 65 milliseconds at a 66 milliseconds a maximum and an average of 65 and also we have uh, erase which just lets you erase files or delete them basically it's just like delete but uh, yeah um, let's see here you can also do F T Y P E which is F type which is basically file type and you can see it shows you every single file type where it's located in your computer uh, you just look for where you want to look at uh, as you can see right here it says word template point eight and it shows you where it's located in your directories uh, in your computer uh, so also that's okay um, it's a compact which uh, basically displays and you can alter the compression of files in your NTFS partitions uh, I don't want to do that because I don't really want to uh, do it again also type in CMD basic command all it does is tell you the version of your CM Microsoft Windows version all rights reserved and all that good stuff uh, CMD basically just starts a new instance of Windows command interpreter but okay and um, to get rid of all this information all you have to do is type in CLS and it clears your screen you start off blank new um, also as you remember title and uh, CS3 tutorials and changes your title of your command prompt to CS3 tutorials and that's about it um, let's see here I want to show you two more things okay go to in your type in a t t r i b which basically stands for attribute go hit enter and this is all your attributes that you have for your um for all your uh i don't want to say files but it uh, yeah it is it is your files excuse me it displays and you are able to change your file attributes within that within attribute uh command also C O N V E R T, which is convert. It allows you, it lets you convert fat, fat volumes. Uh, fat is another partition for Windows. There's fat, fat32, NTFS. Um, I'm not going to get into that. I'll pay, post tutorials on that later after I do after I finish with command prompts stuff for intermediate and uh, expert. Um, but basically, this lets you convert fat volumes to NTFS. And but you cannot convert your current drive, so I'm not going to mess with that either. Um, what else is there? Um, C A C L S. Uh, C A C L S. Uh, let you this this displays and lets you modify access control list um, of the, your files. So that's all it does. What comes up with the you, all you have to do is type that in. Then you just type in this uh, right here that shows you what to type in and uh, tells you what each of these commands do when you type them in. Uh, what went down too far. Um, that's probably all I'm going to show you for now. Uh, so stay tuned for my part three. Technically, it's going to be episode three of my tutorial of Windows Command Prompt. Um, uh, check me on Twitter at uh, HTTP colon slash slash www.twitter.com slash cs3 tutorial 001 uh, follow me on twitter uh, I update it all the time tells you what videos I'm doing all that stuff uh, subscribe to my videos comment and rate also please post some video responses if you want to um, showing me that you learned how to do this and saying oh wow thank you for this tutorial if you want if you didn't already know this because this is tutorials for beginners and I will also be doing intermediate and then expert after I finish with the basic stuff. So, all right, uh, this is CS3 tutorials, and um, this is what I'm going to do here for you guys. Title: uh, See you later. And I put it up here. All right, guys, see you guys later. Subscribe, rate, comment, and follow me on Twitter. All right, Twitter is also going to be in the description link, and uh, the first episode of this video will be in the annotations. I will have an animation link. Alright, see you guys later.